right, so today we're at Berracina. This is actually where the pina colada was handcrafted for the very first time. It was invented right here. So we are going to be giving this a try. There they are. Welcome to Berracina. You excited to try this? All right, so Nicole, we're gonna have to get her a version one since she is not 18. Look how beautiful it is inside, you guys. Oh. And look at how beautiful these cups are that people painted. Yeah. Got shot glasses. It's a very beautiful building. So we have the 60th anniversary of the Pina Colada. Sure, AC. We're choose air conditioning today. So here is the bar. Ooh, I smell good seafood. Oh, Pongo. Beautiful room. Nice, cool AC. Look at that. Really kind of get the umbrella. I like it. And then Nicole got the version so one. Pretty. All right, gotta make sure I got the one with alcohol. Here, can you take that out for me? Thank you, dear. All right, here we go. Oh yeah, this this has alcohol. Oh, okay. So you just wanted to share one. Mm. I know, me too. A little red. Delicious. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is good. So much flavor. How do you like yours? So good. Here, I want the cherries. Ooh, I love the cherries. So are you a cherry fan? She's not. So I get them all. Here you go, buddy. Here you go, the umbrella. Put it up. There you go. It's also wet. Yes, it is. But it'll dry off in a hot side. All right, so this is it. Ooh, it looks good. What is that for me? So I got the garlic shrimp appetizer. Mommy, what is this? Ooh, that is good. A little sampler it's platter. Oh my good. Is That's for you. You can have one that has stuff inside of it. Can't wait to try my shrimp. Alright, we'll get a little bit of lime in here. There we go. Alright. And Lucas is trying new things. How Mom is it? It's very crowded. Yes, she is. Now, what's and in this one? It looks like it's crust and maybe some bread or something. Corn? I got corn fritter. And this is called Mayo Ketchup. Mayo Ketchup. Ketchup and mayonnaise. And if you're a kid, don't worry. This is really good. You will like it. And Nicole got a salad, mm -hmm. top salad. They gave me two things of dressing. It's a Caesar salad. Nice. Mm -hmm. All right, can't wait to dig into the shrimp. Mm -hmm. Smells very good. I love the smell of that garlic and shrimp. All right, let's get a little bit more of the sauce on here. There it is. Very good. Mm. The shrimp is good. We just needed a little appetizer. Great trouble. All 
right, I'm gonna try one bite of this. Mm. Oh, this is a good one. Baratina was very good. Great pina colada. So we're all done. We ate everything, even Lucas had all of his food. Good job. So that means we get to go have ice cream. And we better hurry up before it starts to rain. I think we heard some thunder, so hopefully you'll hold off. All right, let's go find some ice cream. All right, so we're gonna be going to a well-known ice cream place right around the corner from where we just had our pina colada. And it's called Senor Paleta. And I believe it's right around this corner. And we also have a nice view over here where we can eat our ice cream. There it is, I see it. So straight ahead. He's running for ice cream. <laughs> Hola. Hola. Having a good time? Oh yeah, see. Great. All right, go on in. Pecado. That's the one you want. Let's see if they have it. So he wants this from the fort. The 3D ice cream. Oh my goodness, look at that. Right there. You see it? Yeah. yeah. Look, look what they got, you guys. The fried chicken it looks ice cream. Like a fried chicken, but it's ice cream. The pollo. It's right there. Nicole, you should get me. Are they going to translate you anything? They have cheese and guava. Strawberry and pepper. Look at all the flavors, you guys. All right, let's get out of their way. Okay, right across the street, we have some places to sit down and wait till you see the ice cream. Even I just got. And again, there it is. I already have a line going. Oh, watch out. All right, ice cream with a view. like it. Can you see the front of it, buddy? Turn around. Awesome. That's so cool. All right. All right, let's see what you guys all got. I got the coconut with Nutella. Ooh. I bet that one tastes really good. Really good. That looks, good. Like that looks good. It is really good. Nice. And this tastes like Hershey Okay. All right, Eve. Here we go. So let's open our fried oh, chicken up. One. Look at our chicken ice hey guys, cream. I think the birds are checking us out. Mhm. Mm I love how they put it in a box. <laughs> like she just got fried chicken. Is that ice cream? Open it up, babe. Let's see. Thanks, I think. All right, dinner time. Dinner time. With the shape of an ice cream. All right, give it a try. Crunchy on the. Mm -hmm. Very good ice cream. I love I the crunchiness. Need it. Dad, can I wipe it? All right. 
chew you not each other. So weird eating a chicken leg ice cream. You want a bite of it? No, I'm okay. You want to try? All right, here, give me a bite. How's it taste? Mm -hmm. Pretty good. Very good. Right. Well, we're gonna go back to our place, rest up a little bit, and then we're gonna be doing some stuff off camera with her mom. So this is our day at El Moro at the fort and finishing up with a little bit of ice cream. All right, and uh, of course the pina colada, amazing, so good. Back at the kiosk tonight, we decided to stop here. This time we're all the way at the end, and this one is kiosk number 60. So we're gonna be looking for some to-go fried food. Nicole is uh, trying to find those amazing potato balls. We them, they're just a little smaller. Yeah, they do look a little different. <laughs> There's quite a few people here. So they have a lot of seating here. They even have arcade games in the back. Yeah. Well, what do you guys find? Anything interesting here? So far? Two of those. But um, okay. do you want the other one? It just feels like you want I the other one. I think I'll eat two, yeah. I can we'll eat two. Do you really here. want one? Do you, we can get one here and one down there. Yeah. Okay, I'll do that. I can do that. I can do that, yeah, I can do that. All right, so the uh, potato balls look a little bit better at the other location. But it's a little further down, so we're going to drop a little bit down. Now, along with number 60, this one here also have the potato balls. There they are. Good size empanadas. You'll need two of those. Yeah. yeah. Oh, do you want to try the 59? Do you want to look at the 59 real quick? So this is 55. You want to look at the 59 real quick? All right, and I'm sure they have more of these than just these two. But these look really good. All right, here we go. Let's keep going, you guys. So it's not too busy tonight. It's a Tuesday night. Weekends is really when most of them are all open. Doggy. All right, here we go back to number 60. And guys, guess what? Did you know what Nicole said? What's that? She said if any kind of puppy follows her, even oh. like that one maybe, she will be like, yep, I'm keeping this puppy. Because she, <laughs> she wants, wants to keep one. Because huh? she wants a puppy. All right. You want a puppy, huh, Nicole? Take I do home. want a puppy. I want a little puppy. I want like a Rottweiler, a Golden Retriever, oh. or a Black Lab, or a Brown Lab, not a Yellow Lab. Like though. if any puppy follows me, she's going. taking. I'm taking. If there's a little puppy, it's like this big. I'm taking it. I'm All taking right. It. Okay. I'll name it after like if I I'll name it after wherever I find it. So if I find it here, its name will be Lukejo. You got it. Or awesome. maybe peanut. All right, Eve's on a mission here. If we found it, she's looking at something else now. So I like the arepas, but I don't think that's the the soft flaky eerie kind. All right, so she's gonna see if they have three of them. If they have more in the back. But these do kind of look a little smaller than normal. Oh, look at that! They just made some. There they are. 
they are meet uh, what's it called? Can or bottle? Uh, bottle. Okay, yeah. So we'll stay here. Yeah. We'll eat in. So I'm going to also try an arepa. I'll take one of each. There we are. Yes. <laughs> All right, here we go. So this is potato. Sorry for the loud music in the background, but it's nice and hot and fresh. And so inside of this potato ball, we have some uh, seasoned uh, beef. Yeah, it is good. Especially fresh. Mmm, it's hot. All right, so here's the beef. Mmm, how do you like it? Really good. It's yeah, these hot. are good. It is very it's hot. Fresh. But the meat is very well seasoned. I like it. So I tell you. <laughs> what else did you order? Um, I got an arepa. Cold cut right. arepa. Same as me. So good. And you ordered both of them? Yeah. How about you? You're gonna wait for the pizza? So we're gonna be stopping at a local pizza spot that Eve has been waiting to have. So we're gonna stop by there after we're done. So Lucas can have something to eat too. Yeah, he wants pizza. I'll have a pizza. Pizza. All right, you better eat the whole thing. What do you have here? Um, I got it's potato and meat, and then I got a coconut arepa. Looks yummy. Mhm. Mm what do you have, Lucas? Well, I don't have anything yet, but I'm gonna get some pizza later. All right, leaving the kiosk. Another night here. So this was our third trip so far. Nicole had to leave one more time here. Yeah, she leaves tomorrow. No. So sad. I'm uh, not gonna eat when I go back home. I'm gonna starve. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Nicole. She's gonna miss all this great food. I know. It'll come back. All right, so the pizza place we're going to, it is called... William's Pizza. William's Pizza, and it's located in... Luquillo. Luquillo. Oh, a lot of speed bumps here. And when you're in Puerto Rico, be prepared for potholes. You have to always be careful and watch in the road where you're driving. All right, we made it near Luquillo Beach. So right here by the water. So they have two locations and they have a to-go window here and we're gonna give Lucas some pizza and we'll take it back to our place. So this is one of Eve's local favorites for pizza. Uh, medium pizza, half Italian, half cheese for Lucas. All right, it's coming. And we'll take it back to our place, okay? Okay, how many slices will you eat? Two, one, okay. Or three. I'll help you. I'll have one or two also. So that's why we're gonna get a medium. Or I have three. Okay, you got it. Alright, Lucas wanted a reveal of our pizza. Three. Well, of course it needs tape. Oh, they did put tape on it for us, okay. What? That I said, is yes, they did. Fine. Hold on, let's see if I can't get it. I can smell that. Three. Ready? Two, one. Yay, pizza. So we have cheese pizza for you. Yay. And then we ended up getting half sausage. Ooh, so this is a I might have very one slice tomato -y of based pizza, which I like. Mm -hmm. Okay, oh. Lucas, here you go. One slice of cheese pizza and one slice of sausage, but you have to be here on the couch. No, no, no. Alright. Sit on up. Let's oh, move my uh, computer. Yeah. All right. Enjoy the pizza. Uh, and we're gonna call that a night. And tomorrow Nicole leaves. Oh, oh. No, no, we don't want her to leave. Yeah. But she's gotta get back to do some swimming. And there's gonna be there's gonna be room in the bed for you. No. Yes. 
All right, so here's to Nicole. Here's the pizza. How do you like it? Did you try it? Try it, Lucas. Let me see it. Blow on it, though. Blow on it. It's thin crust. This is excellent. So this is called William's Pizza. Out of not, 10. Not, ten. Not a 10 out of 10. Not a 10? Um, probably like a 20 out of 10. <gasps> More than wow. a 10. <clears throat> awesome. Water. All right. We'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Bye, Nicole. Bye. We'll see you. We'll see you in the next one, bro.